Well, I'm Artifacts to Mars. And look at this headline. Hawaii Volcano Raises Concerns of Eruptions Along West Coast. These people are worried about something. And they're starting to admit it. In this case, they're saying, okay, maybe uh, this thing could possibly start setting off these West Coast volcanoes. That seems to be what they're saying. Now, uh, I did the video about the small earthquakes here. Now they're talking about the West Coast and that Hawaii volcano has uh, blown its top. This, this stuff all started back in 2004 with that monster earthquake that caused a monster tidal wave, which wiped out something like 400,000 people or something. The Asian one. And now, we have this stuff going on. There's a lot of anxiety out there, says Liz Wetsby, geologist at the U.S. GS Cascades Volcano Observatory in Vancouver, Washington, in the shadow of Mount, Mount St. Helens. They see destruction and people get nervous. Well, what do you expect? Kileo, uh, and Hawaii's Big Island is threatening to blow its top in the coming days or weeks, such as sputtering lava for a week, forcing about 22,000 people to evacuate, destroying two dozen homes, and threatening a geothermal plant. Experts fear the volcano could hurl ash and boulders the size of refrigerators miles into the air. And it goes on to talk about the Ring of Fire. I just want to point, point out, these people are scared. There's no question. Not that I can blame them. There's stuff going on. I mean, we've seen quakes out in the Midwest, and now they're starting to happen here. There's something going on, and it's big, folks. We just don't know what. Uh, I don't know. Stand by. Stand by, folks, because there is something happening. That's all I got to say for now. These people are worried, and they've just started admitting to it via this article. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching. Uh, I don't know what to tell you. Right.